What's, What's up, everybody? everybody? It's Log Tata, your coach, coach of the Atlanta, Atlanta Dreamers. Dreamers. We, we head into a big week. week. Dare, Dare I say our biggest week yet. yet. We, we go, go on to take Coach DeChico, Coach of the UNC Tar Heelist, Coach of the number one murdering machine of our current Pokemon League, Urshu Rapid Strike, aka Master Paku. What can I say? This week we will play with respect for our enemy. We have a lot of respect for this coach. We think very highly of him. It would be an honor to lose to him, and it would be glorious to win against him. Join us in another round as your Atlanta Dream Eaters chase their title, chase the glory, chase the name, and champion. Let's go Dream Eaters. Welcome, everybody, to the Week 4 matchup with the Atlanta Dream Eaters and the UNC Tar Heelist, coached by the incredibly talented DeChico. Now we're just joining the lobby and we have a moment before everybody joins to go ahead and uh, give them, we've got a moment before everybody joins to go ahead and give it a quick breakdown. So we're looking at Mew, Rotom Fan, Arcanine, Corsola Galar, Obama Snow, and Weezing. I'm a little bit nervous guys because Blake is an incredibly talented battler and I want to give him my best. We're not seeing Urshifu Rapid Strike. I'm not totally surprised by that. I can see him really not liking it because of Thunderous. Um, but that's not the worst news. Um, let's think about what we expect here. I expect Obama Snow to be bringing a Roar Veil. That's fine because we have Hitmon Top with Brick Break. Um, I expect Weezing to be grounded. Uh, so that he collects Toxic Spikes. I think he would be uh, worried about Toxic Spikes. Um, last week he watched me bring Toxic Spikes against the Chicago Snowballs, and I'm sure that he didn't want that to happen, so he's bringing Weezing as a answer to that. Uh, the good news is I brought, uh, I did not bring spikes on my Neo Queen. Um, let's see what else we've got here to worry about. <laughs> what a great coach. What a great guy. Um, I really do think the world of him. Okay, Obama Snow, I really expect to be bringing Aurora Veil. Uh, we don't have something to get rid of Hail, but we have Brick Break on our Hitmon top to break through that, which is pretty huge. Um, let's see what else. Who wants a piece of Tangrowth? Arcanine wants a piece of Tangrowth. Obama Snow wants a piece of Tangrowth. Weezing wants a piece of Tangrowth. Of course, Legaler doesn't mind Tangrowth. Rotom Fan doesn't mind Tang Growth. Really, his whole team doesn't care that much, but fortunately, we're bringing Assault Vest, uh, especially defensive Tang Growth. Uh, we have Audino as well, fully specially invested. Our Hitmon Top is also specially invested. Uh, Thunderous is full speed. Thunderous and Dragapult both full uh, timid nature with 252 special attack. Dragapult is pretty huge in our game here. Nido Queen also huge. If we get some um, Thunder Waves off from our Thunderous, that will be huge. I kind of expect. Ooh, I don't know if I expect a T Wave or a uh, Thunder Wave Rotom Fan. Or I'm sorry, a Choice Scarf Rotom Fan. But I could certainly see it as a means to certainly screw with me. I could see an Obama Snow lead. I could see a Rotom Fan lead. Well, thinking through what we want to start off with. I'm going to lead off with Thunderous, I believe. Um, Thunderous doesn't really mind anything except a Choice Scarf Mew. I think we're safe to lead off with Thunderous. We have Volt Switch. We're not seeing Klefki, which is pretty big for Dragapult. We're also not seeing Urshifu, which 
is pretty big for everything. All right, I think we're gonna lead off with Thunderous. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see. I'm curious as to what he expected there. I think we're okay to bolt switch here. We'll certainly see if he's scarfed. That's big damage. That's big, big damage on Arcanine. Okay, I'm not sure what we're going to go into here. I'm curious as to what could be going on. Unless he's just going with the morning sun to see what I was thinking. Maybe he's flash fire? Expecting? Huh, I'm not sure. Also, it looks like my names didn't save, but that's okay. Hmm, we'll see here. Um, I think some of our safest bets are to go into Tinky Winky. Odno or Tangro. I think we just go on a Tinky Winky and see what happens here. Oh. Alright. That's pretty huge. Now, does he predict me a switch here? Uh, ooh, let's see here. I think we go into Not Blue Spaghetti. We get Regenerator off. If he dies from his own Flare Blitz, that's huge for us. And I live. We also know he's physically offensive now. Oh, no weather from this man. Oh, we also noticed that we forgot to take synthesis off. So that's going to be a wasted move slot, which is hugely disappointing, but that's okay. Okay, I believe he is staying in and going for a... Maybe an icicle crash? Blizzard does big damage, but or do we switch into Hitmon top here? I think we switch into Hitmon top with the eject button. Yeah, that's that's okay for us. We don't mind that. I guess we expect him to make a play, so we're gonna go Toxic. We're gonna see if we can hit this Mew with Toxic. He might stay and go for Psychic, that's fine. We're fully specially defensive. We might, I don't think we die to that. Oh, 
Let's see here. No, we survive. We're going toxic. We're going to expect rocks. Or we're going to expect him to think we're switching out. That's fine. We don't mind that. going to Tinky Winky so we can switch out and get Regenerator off. Yep, that's fine. I think we go for a Reflect here. We like our light screen Reflect. I don't think he could kill Tinky Winky if he wanted to right now. Let's see here. I think we switch out. I want that health. Let's see here. Where do we go for a thunder wave? Try ever a thunder wave. I think we live whatever he's got because we're fully specially invested. Unless he crits me or he gets a high roll. Ooh, okay, we don't mind that. to switch out. So we're going to go into not blue spaghetti. We're going to go right for a knockoff here. <laughs> He's such a G, dude. for a Giga Drain, try to stay alive. Hmm. Okay, so he is special. does big, big, big damage right now. But I think we got speed. Actually, maybe not.
We do not outspeed with anything. Let's see, I guess we go for Zoom Zoom Dragon. We give it our best here. We just hope. I think we need a parry here to not lose. <laughs> wow, that was an expert. Yeah, we might be lost. We might have lost, guys. That's a shame. We just hope we can get another. Wow, we get lucky. So let's see. There's a chance. There is a chance. Very small one. Do we think that he brought neutralizing gas wheezing? I don't. It makes me think not the way he just brought it in. Because, I mean, obviously he would die. Go for flank throw, I guess. Or we want rocks up. We want rocks. Yeah. So I think we switch to Arduino. Yeah, I think we switch to Arduino here. This is a hugely uphill battle now. Hugely uphill battle without Tangrowth and Dragapult.
Go back in Arduino and hope for uh, go for the T wave. Oh, we don't mind that. Go for heel belt. Go for knockoff. Trust, you trust. I'm just gonna go for heel bell. Where we try to go into Mac would be to get our toxic off. Blocks by going back on the course with G, we'll go for a toxic. And we're happy with that. Okay. Not great, but it's okay. Go back in a tinky winky. Let's think about that. We got 21 with 95, 11 with 65, but he's got less defense. We go back in the Maccabee. If he stays in for whatever reason, that's okay. Because we're gonna go for toxic. Sad. I'll 
switching to Thunderous. I don't imagine him. If he stays in, that's fine. He can stay in with Rotom Fan and go for another Air Slash. We got lucky there. We got really lucky there. It's huge for us to keep Rox up. Rox does huge damage to so much of his team. Okay. That's all right. <laughs> That's funny. I'm not sure what he does here. I think he's sacking off his Arcanine. Is some damage that must be banded. All right, I expect wheezing, or I'm sorry, oh. I expect a physical Obama Snow. I, I expect physical because he doesn't bring Snow Warning for the Aurora Veil and the Free Blizzards. I don't know why he wouldn't bring Snow Warning if he was physical. Or I don't know why he wouldn't bring Snow Warning if he was special. And so we gotta switch out of Tinky Winky. Tinky Winky's way too important right now. And I think we gotta sack something off. That was a really good play on his part, getting rid of the rocks. Hmm. We're in a bad spot here. Ice does big damage to everything on my team. All right, let's see. I think what we have to do here, actually, is kind of crazy. I think we need to let Hitmontop die, and then we bring in Thunderous for a Thunder Wave. Hope, hope that it uh, gets the pair out, but I don't think it will. But that's what we gotta do. That's all right. So we're gonna sack off Hitmontop, bring in Thunderous, go for a Thunder Wave. That slow will let Nido Queen live. Weezing has been a, such a problem. Jeez. Okay, so it is physical. So we go for a Thunder Wave here. We hope we connect, and we hope we get a pair. If not, I mean, it is what it is. It's never a dull game with Blake. What a great game. That Mew just jacked my whole team up. 
I'm proud of how we're playing right now. Regardless of the outcome, I am proud of how we're playing, given the fact that we had that mute to deal with. We got so lucky. It should have been over, but... All he knows that I've got is Volt Switch, so maybe he gets scared and does something crazy here. Maybe he's scared of Focus Blast. Maybe he's scared of Incinerate. Who knows? That'd be awesome. <laughs> it wouldn't kill, but... See no reason not to go into Tinky Winky and roll the dice. What wow, that's huge, huge for us. Wow, that is huge for us. So we go for a reflect here. Very not good. That is very, very, very not good. Okay, so here's the situation. I need to switch now. If he gets another SD up, his Ice Shard can kill, but but there's a chance I get a pair now or the next turn, so I have to switch now. I have to switch now and go for Flamethrower. I think, oh, unless he goes for Wood Hammer or something of the sort. If he goes for a wood hammer or something of the sort, he knocks out Nido Queen. I think he knows that. So I think I get to roll the dice and switch. Here we go. Let's see if the game ends here. Now we literally only we can only win if this kills. And he doesn't get Ice Shirt off. Here we go. I think it's the, this. This decides the game. Psych. 
great game, sir. Just absolutely great game. Big damage. What a game. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the kind of coach you want to lose to. That's it. That's our game. Um, that's our first loss for the season, and what a loss it was. What an admirable game to such a wonderful, wonderful coach and a wonderful friend. Blake, you earned it. That was an amazing win. I got so lucky to even stay in the match. The moment you used that weakness policy meme, I was toast. Super well played. Absolutely not what I planned for at all. You earned every bit of that win. We appreciate you guys joining and watching. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. We love doing these and we hope you enjoy them. So go ahead and leave a like, comment, and subscribe about what are your craziest moments in this game were for you. And uh, we'll see you next time, guys. Thanks.